hello coders welcome back to tutorial so guys if you want to launch world then it is a great idea go for it because guys, it is very simple to use and very easy to create a new applications with so world and you can just write plain html with javascript and you can create a web application just like react.js or any other library but guys the basic problem you face while learning the Swelt is creating the new project with the Swelt because guys there is no one method for it like uh, this is the earlier method which was used to create the swivel tabs from the templates and as if you come to this repo now it is saying that this is no more supported and this is not going to be updated in future and guys if you come to the swivel website then it is going to show you this command which is not actually for swivel it is for swivel kit so guys if you don't want to use swivel kit just the swivel app this is not the command for you so what is that you can do now so there is a method for this you can create a swell tab with the white white is a build tool or a scaffolding tool for creating new projects with react next.js swell and many other frameworks or libraries so guys if you want to create a new swell tab then i'm going to show you this first method so if you want to use this first method of cloning this template from github repo with a digit then you have to just run this command npx digit several js template and your project name and it is going to create a new project for you so let's try this open a command prompt and run this command npx digit basically guys digit is a scaffolding tool which is going to clone a a github repo or any git repo in your computer and it's going to create a new project based on that so let's run this command and write your project folder here like my app and it is going to clone this repo from swell.js github and it's going to create a new project with the name my app so it is already done and you can see this output if it is done so if you can see this in my directory it is the project which is created now so let's run this command to open vs code in this project and guys you can see here the project is already here and this is the basic swelt app which you need to get started so after that you have to run npm install to install the, all the required packages or libraries and guys once this command is run and all the packages are installed you can run this command npm run dev to run this project and it's going to open a development server in your project so you can see here the project is running and guys if you open this src folder you can see there app.svelte and main.js and app.svelte is the file which you want to edit for customizing or creating your application this is the code which is reflecting in this project here now so if i change something here so if i write something here like h1 then it is going to show in our project so that's how you can create the swelt app in first method but guys there is another method which is which is also very very easy to get started so now let's see how we can use that so if you come to the Svelte docs you can see here it is written that if you don't want to create a full fledged application framework instead you want to build a simple front end only site with the Svelte then you can run this command npm init white and it is going to show us prompt to create a new projects so let's run this command by opening command prompt it is going to ask us to install this and guys now i have to write the project name so let's write it as my first app and guys now it will ask which type of project i want to create so there are a lot of options like vanilla html project 
Review project, React project, Preact, Lit, Svelte, and others. So for now, I'm going to select this Svelte, and you can select any of these forms by pressing the arrow keys up and down. So let's select the Svelte, and it will ask if you want to use the TypeScript or just the JavaScript. So I'm going to use the just the JavaScript. And guys, the project is now created very quickly. So now we can just run these commands that is cd my first app and now i'm going to open vs code inside this project and after that you can see here it is showing to install all the packages with the npm install and run this project with the npm run dev so guys if you can see this project so if you want to install this then you can install this extension for the several applications so guys what i'm saying that is if you can see here in this project you can see similar structure like earlier you can see here the public folder and src folder but in src folder you can see here a lot of files and index.html will be going to in the root project once you open this open app.svelte you can see the code here and now we have to install all the packages by running npm install and all the packages inside the packages.json will be going to install so guys if you come to this app.svelte again you can see here all the required code for this application is only inside this file that is all the scripts all the HTML and all the CSS is inside this file itself so this is the beauty of the file that you don't need to make it complex you can just make it as simple as possible and you can create your website or application so now as the packages have installed you can run this command npm run dev and guys it is going to open our development server again then you can see here the project is now live so guys that's how you can create a swell app with the file 2 and if you click on this this project is working fine so let's change something inside this project so for example let's write our legendary code here that is that is hello coders and now it is working fine so that means you have successfully created a swelt app and now you can build your project or build your application as you like and if you want to build this application then you can run this command npm run build and it is going to build all these html and css file inside this dist folder which is just created and you can just upload it on your server or any deployment server to make it live on internet so guys that is it for this video i showed you how you can you create a new swelt app in two ways one way was using these template repositories and one way was using the white which is uh, way faster than this so guys that's it for this video i hope you like this video if you like this video then don't forget to subscribe to your own stay healthy keep coding and keep watching tutorial for more videos like this in future